tell you something that's like him. If you want something, you gotta open your mouth to say it's closed mouth, don't get fed. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> it's your girl Fredo's G. <laughs> Fredo's G, and I'm back with another video. So guys, I'm about to go on a solo date. This was like very spontaneous. I did not plan to do this today. Like I initially was supposed to take my birthday videos today, but the weather is just, it's just acting a little weird. Like it's acting a little weird. And I'm just like, you know what? I don't want to risk driving 35 minutes to the location. And I get there and the weather is trash and the lighting is bad. And then I'm gonna get pissed. But yeah, I just decided why not like go on a random solo date. I've been wanting to go on a solo date but things have been happening like i've had reasons to go out or like show up for people or hang out with friends and i'm just like you know what today let's just let's just spend quality time with myself because why not so i'm going to this one um freaking indian restaurant i don't know why i've been craving indian food recently because i haven't had it in a minute and i'm just like why not so yeah i'm gonna take y'all with me on this solo date and you know just i don't know we'll just go with the vibe because like i said this is spontaneous why not vlog it i talk about solo dates sometimes on my channel but i never really like show you guys while i'm doing the solo date so let's take you with me it's gonna be really fun gonna be really interesting and yeah let's go let's let's go let's go let's go i'm super excited and oh i can show you outfit of the day you know what i'm gonna put it next to the screen because i'm doing a reel so y'all can see the outfit but it's this white shades white top some jean and this red bag you know i wanted to do a casual i don't know chill vibe not to dressy and you know you know what let's just go because i talk a lot hey guys so a quick update i'm at the restaurant right now and it's pretty empty like it's just my lucky day like literally there's nobody here except me i'll show you the vibe of the restaurant it's pretty cute it's this one indian restaurant like i absolutely love it this is like literally my fourth or fifth time being here and it's just amazing i'm not gonna talk too much while being here because honestly it's a solo day and i just want to have a solo time with myself but yeah i'll keep you guys updated so guys my food is here i got the chicken biryani some naan bread mango rassi water and i'm just about to dive in the food looks so good i can't wait to eat it i just finished my cute solo dates i was there for about maybe an hour and a half i think and I was reading, yeah, like I literally turned off my phone for like an hour just to make sure I was like really present. It was really nice. Like I was just reading my book. I read the first chapter, which is pretty good. But I don't know. I feel so exhausted, guys. I'm literally about to go home, take a nap, I think, or just chill. I just need to lay down because I'm like so tired right now. I thought I'd be able to give an update on my solo date right after, but I'm so tired. So I'll probably talk to you guys after taking a rest and... I see i'm about to drive home now hey guys not me coming up here looking crazy but fact is i cannot be bothered honestly i came home literally went up changed went to bed and i've been in bed for the past hours just watching netflix chilling and i know i said i was gonna update about my solo trip but uh, i said solo trip solo um date but I was freaking tired, guys. When I tell you I was so tired, I was so tired. Like, I'm just gonna make this a weekly vlog because why not? Like, I have a lot of things planned. Tomorrow, I'm gonna be washing my hair and then retouching my hair. And then I'll be going to the store to go get extensions for my braids. <laughs> I'm getting braids done. I love, love, love when I get braids done because I don't have to worry about putting a wig on. And it's just easier when you're going out. And I'm about to go on a trip. <laughs> So I've, been, I've been like working on the plans for my birthday trip but yo when i tell you i'm just realizing how obsessed i am with like planning like literally i have to plan everything to a t to stay organized i just love being organized and i've always been like that even as a kid but yeah see you guys tomorrow i don't know why before i used to feel like i always have to look my best when i'm on youtube but now I'm like, hell nah. You guys are gonna be like, I literally am about to drop a video about self love. And this is all part of the journey, like showing every side of me. Like, girl, you don't have to be all glammed up every time. But yeah, and I'm trying to be consistent on YouTube. I really, really wanna be consistent on YouTube. 
for those. You have to keep yourself accountable. If you really wanted to, you would. So yeah, I'm trying to be more consistent up here, keeping myself accountable. Talking about planning, I'm trying to plan my videos for the rest of the month because I'm trying to make sure we're on it with this YouTube stuff. But yeah, good night. It's another day and I'm literally just about to perm my hair right now. I think I mentioned it yesterday that I'm gonna perm my hair because I am doing braids and I need my hair slick, slick. I'm just about to put on some YouTube next to me just so I can enjoy this whole hair process. But yeah, back to the monologue. Guys, I'm done with the perm and I'm just gonna keep it on for about 10 minutes because I really really need this hair perm like that's the update for now but yeah I'm watching a YouTube video right now because I'm like bored so that's gonna take time while I wait on my hair to get ready so yeah let's just put a YouTube video so guys a quick outfit of the day is this black top black biker shorts black bag some black shades and i have some cute slides on I don't know if you can see it but yeah like this year i've been making it a goal like for myself to like dress up even when i'm home like even if i'm not going anywhere like i still like wear a comfy casual outfit at home but still make them look cute like i don't know i just feel like you feel better when you dress well or when you dress comfy and like cute or whatever that's just me like not everybody has to and i promise you not every day not every day but like a lot of the times i'm actually like pretty cute in the house i try my best to like but obviously we have those updates now where we're not really you know all that cute but yeah i try my best when i'm home to actually wear casual outfits but still make it look cute and let me get, give you guys a fashion tip like if you want to elevate a casual like home wear or like just a casual fit entirely throw on some shades have some nice cute accessories like your earrings bracelet necklace bag and some cute slides and when i tell you your outfit is going to be like elevated like crazy you got that tip from me okay? hey guys so quick update i'm at the boba tea shop getting a boba tea it's been a month since i have boba tea so i'm enjoying my boba tea for the month but yeah I am super excited and guess what I was supposed to pay eight dollars but then they're giving me five dollars yeah five dollars off for my birthday so mm -mm, we saved some coins I will always be happy if I have to save money and sign so yeah that was nice not having to pay full price So guys, I just got my boba tea. Ah, I get so excited when I have boba tea. Like it literally makes my day. But I'm about to go pick up my food. I ordered the chicken Philly. So yeah, I'm about to go pick that up from this Arabian. Oh my gosh, this is giving bougie. Oh, I should take a picture here in my car one day. Like this is so cute. But yeah, I'm about to go do that and then go home, watch some Netflix and chill for the night. Like I'm having such a good day, great week. I'm so blessed. Thank you God for all my blessings. I'm praying, I'm praying for everyone watching this video. You're blessed. God is blessing you wherever you're at. Amen. But yeah, I'm out of head home now. See y'all later. Bye. I am back home. I'm literally about to eat, watch TV, and we're going to call it a night. I'm about to watch some Netflix and we're just going to call it a night, guys. Hey guys, it's another day and I'm at the airport supposed to be in Ohio yesterday. I don't know if I said it, but yeah, I was supposed to be traveling. But unfortunately, my flight got canceled yesterday. But yeah, I'm um, on my way now, going back and trying again today. And I'm just kind of pissed because my flight was cut short by a day. But hopefully, my flight's not canceled today and I do make it. But yeah, I'm on my way now to go check in my stuff and go wait for my flight. We board at 12.40 and it's currently 12. So your girl's good. One thing about me, I'm gonna never be late to the airport, it's never. <laughs> but yeah, I'll talk to y'all once I'm set it in. Bye. It's been a minute since you last saw me, I think two days now. Yeah, I haven't vlogged in like two days, but guys, when I told you the story of my life. Oh my gosh, okay, where do I start from? I think the last clip y'all are gonna see is me arriving in um, 
Columbus, Ohio, right? And I was so excited coming out to see my family. I don't know if I told you guys why I'm coming home, but I'm going home. I'm home to like, I'm here now. But yeah, I'm home to like braid my hair. Like, I'm so bougie, you guys. When I tell you, my sister is like the best braider, <laughs> period. Surat's beauty. Like, she's the only one I ever let to like touch my hair, her and my mom. So I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna fly down home to braid my hair for my birthday and then go back. Like, literally, it was gonna be a two day trip. Wait, right? Two day trip was this was gonna be about. I come home, guess what? I can't find my baggage. What in the world? I'm like, yo, I start to panic. I'm so upset because I don't know if I told you guys, my flight got canceled first. So I'm pissed off. First, y'all canceled my flight, cut my trip short by a day. And now I'm here, my bag is not here. So I go into the baggage claim or whatever, and I'm like, hey, my box isn't here. And then she's like, she checks the slip and she's like, oh yeah, like your box was never sent to Columbus, Ohio. I was like, wait, what? I was like, come, 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 come again. What do you mean? My box was never sent to Columbus, Ohio. She's like, yeah, whoever checked your box only sent it to Nashville, which was my connecting flight from like Virginia to Nashville, Nashville to Ohio. So she's like, oh yeah, whoever checked your bathroom, you checked it to Nashville and not Ohio. I was like, oh my gosh, like, I was so upset. I'm about to be on my period. So it's like, you know, hormones are all over. I'm literally about to cry or be, I, I didn't even, I'm surprised I didn't even cry. Cause I was like, just so emotional and so upset at that time. But yeah, you know, she's like, it's fine. We're going to put it on the next flight and you should get it latest by tonight or tomorrow. And she gave me the whole stuff to uh, track it shot. And I was just tracking it the entire day. I call at night and they're like, oh, you're gonna get your bag by three something a.m. in the morning. When I tell you the second day when I woke up, my, I just literally oh, like woke up out of panic because I was like, oh my gosh, my box, I need to get it. And I saw they gave me a missed call. And then I went into the airport the second day, which was yesterday, to go pick up my box. And I got my box, everything was intact. And guess the best part? They gave me a $100 voucher for the whole Wahala. And yeah, so they gave me an extra like $100 voucher. So next time I have a flight, you know, $100, it's checked out already but yeah and then again look at me let me tell you something this life here if you want something you gotta open your mouth to say it's closed mouth don't get fed so i go in and i'm talking to the lady i'm like hey like you know you guys canceled my flight i didn't get my box in time and you know my trip has been cut short because of y'all and i like to extend my trip because guys when i told you when i woke up yesterday i was supposed to go on my flight today i'm like there's no on earth i'm getting on a plane like that's crazy i only just got here the day before yesterday, I am not leaving today. Like, I'm tired, like, I'm stressed. But yeah, she's like, oh, okay, you know, we understand. And she's like, we're going to let you on um, extended flight. And I'm just like, am I going to have to pay for it? And she's like, no, you don't have to pay for it. It doesn't be free. And boom, boom, sha, I got my box in. We're all good, you know, but let me extend my flight. So I'm going to be staying home for like five days. I initially was supposed to be home for a day and a half, but I mean, now I'm low-key, low-key happy they lost my box because I got an extra $100 and they extended my flight for free. So, can't complain. We good out here. I'm going to show you this, my sister's perfume, Valentino perfume. I don't know if you guys know it, but this perfume is, oh, love it. Love it. And that's the scent for the day. Oh, love it. It smells so good. I'm going to go eat. I'm not really sure. I'm expecting my period in like two days, TMI, but yeah, I've just been feeling uneasy. Like, I hit that feeling like days before your period is about to come, you're just in a weird space. But yeah, I'm about to go eat downstairs. Maybe I'll show you my food, maybe not. We won't see about that. But yeah, I'm about to head out. Here's the good food my beautiful mother made. We have the turkey pepper soup. I don't know what this is. This is like a shrimp beef veggie. And some watermelon. I made a watermelon drink. Maybe one day in a different vlog, I'll show you guys how to make it. And I have a corn on the side for just snack. So guys, I'm just about to dig in and go ahead and eat. Watching this one movie called Purple Hearts on Netflix. I've been seeing it pop up on my recommendation page a lot. So I'm just gonna watch that while I enjoy my beautiful meal. You feel me? Hey guys, so it's a few hours in the day. I'm sorry my vlogging has been all over the place, but y'all, when I tell you. I'm literally just trying to chill. I really am. But yeah, I just finished working out. What is that? Oh, it's on the stuff. Okay. I really just finished working out like a few hours ago. I worked out for like two hours. That was nice. So I'm about to do my, I took a shower now and I'm just about to do my skincare routine. And I'm like, why not vlog it? So I'm going to show you guys my skincare routine. Like I have a very sensitive skin. So my skincare has to be very short, very simple, nothing crazy. But yeah, first thing is this Polish Choice. 
calming toner. I use a Garnier cleanser to wash my face first and I'll probably put a screenshot somewhere. And that's my cleanser. And then step two, I go in with this toner and I just you know, put on this cotton pad and I go ahead and tone my skin. Right after that, I go in with my Amos White. This is like my skin treatment. I've been using this since I have like really bad acne. And I just tap it in. One time I was watching a vlog and I saw the girl do this. <laughs> and ever since then, I've been like literally doing this on my skin. And my last routine, which is the fourth step, I go ahead with this altar. Yeah, Ultra, yeah, Ultra Repair Cream. Keeps my skin very hydrated. I used to struggle with like dry skin after I went through my acne, but um, this helped a lot. And that's it, literally that's it for my nighttime. So guys, I'm about to go to bed and, oh, I look weird, but whatever. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to continue this vlog here. If I do, we'll see about that. If not, thank you so much for watching this vlog. It's going to be... Yeah, you know what? I highly doubt that I'm going to continue this vlog, honestly. Because I have a lot going on in the next few days. And I will not be able to vlog, unfortunately. Because I'm just going to be getting those ish done. And it's nothing fun anyways. I'm just going to be braiding my hair. And going to go get my license tag renewed yeah that's all i'm doing the next few days and i'm back home but you guys gonna get a vacation prep um i don't know if that's my next video we're gonna figure it out i highly doubt i think i have a video coming out before then and then the next one but i promise y'all like i'm posting weekly and you guys take my word for it but yeah thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like subscribe comment this is like chill days in my life it's so sad i'm beginning to vlog more when nothing crazy is happening and like the past few months when things were happening your girl wasn't vlogging but it's all good i like the whole chill vibe going on nothing crazy nothing fancy love it but yeah guys i'm just about to watch you two watch some videos and go to bed thank you so much for watching bye guys Fun is got to know feeding my holy fire.